So now we are going to check in and I'll turn this over. Hey, pre kindergarten, are you ready? Smudge 
scowled and bellowed, What the place is it? Then the whole crew dug in, eating hook over fist. Except for old Smudge, who spat out his bite. The captain will eat it. The scurvy crew ate until there was no more. Then, and, and, and burp.
what? A decorative name. And when they were finished, they had a parade. A very joyful one. <laughs> Confetti, they cheered. While back in the room, everyone stood there and sneered. They cleaned up his ship. Why, he just couldn't stand it. They'd stop all this cleaning. Yes, he would demand it. So he gathered them all at the edge of the sea. And he said, he was too for his need and her need. Introduce themselves, or would you like to introduce them? Yes, I would. It's on, I believe in it. Tess, all oh, right. Sorry about that. So, uh, yes, these hires have been working very hard for you this week and last week and week before. So, obviously, thanks to the parents for helping them get ready for this. These amazing costumes that they've provided them with today. We tried our best to stay to the original book, which by the way, was donated to our classroom by lovely Mrs. Crabtree. So thank you, Mrs. Crabtree, for the inspiration. Um, and thank you to Mrs. Smith and the tech crew. They were wonderful and professional and made my young friends here uh, feel very um, comfortable with the technology and gave them some great pointers on how to make themselves heard. I wish I would have listened and got my microphone on the time, but you know, we're all learning. Um, and then thank you, Mrs. Robinson, for 
uh, building these great dividers that we use as our ship today. We repurposed those. They used to be in the technology room. So thank you for your handiwork, Ms. Robinson. And other than that, thank you to this amazing crew of the Muddy Doubloon for their spirit and their, um, their hard work on this. Thank you.